under glass is untested and weak. What do you want? Sorry, sorry, that damn Krogan's love poems are getting on my nerves. Is that Krogan bothering you? No, no, you don't need to hurt him or anything. He's harmless. Which, I know, Krogan, so it's hard to believe. His name is Char. We're kind of dating, but, well, we're on a break. And he's trying to show me how sensitive he is by, well, wooing me. It's really bad. It doesn't seem common for Asari to date Krogan. What brought you two together? He's a fun guy. Really smart. Especially for a Krogan. And he's got a good job as a transport technician. It's fun to join a mercenary guild or dance at bars for a few centuries, but eventually you hit the matron stage, you know? Then you get your back tattoo removed, let your scalp go back to its natural blue, and settle down with someone dependable. Why are the two of you on a break? He's serious. Serious, as in talking about kids. Char is a great guy to date, but for something permanent... Krogans live long lives. It's not like dating a human where you just stick it out for a century till they die. Uh, no offense. It made me wonder if he really likes me. Or if he just wants kids. He can't have them any other way, you know. Because of the genophage. That sounds like a question you should ask him. I did. I don't think he realized that our kids would always have been a sorry. Nanasari don't always get that we're not taking alien DNA, we're just using it to randomize some of the genetic information. Anyway, Char was quiet for a long time. Then he said that he'd love our girls no matter what color they were. You need to talk to your boyfriend. He's just gonna keep shouting poetry until you do. I know, but it's tough. I like him a lot. Hell, I love him. But I don't know if he's permanent bond material. Not with blood rage. Look at him. He's obviously crazy about you. Is he? I mean, what if he just wants to have kids? Am I just his baby-making machine? He said I wasn't, but... If he said that, then you either trust him, so you have nothing to worry about, or you don't, and you've already decided. I... I guess I hadn't thought about it like that. And I do trust him, if he said it. I'm going to talk to him. Here, I've given you a discount at the terminal. Thanks for the help.